Welcome back to Chasey News. I'm Bill Spadia. So you're a casting agent, and you can pick anyone you want to play the role of Princess Diana in a big-time movie. Who would you pick? Well, that movie is happening, and the choice for the leading role may surprise you. It's Thursday night. Time to bring in celebrity insider Deanna Williams. Deanna, you know I'm on the edge of my seat with this Princess Di info, sort of. How you doing? I'm great, Bill. How are you? The actress is Kristen Stewart. You may remember her, the 30-year young actress from the Twilight series. And when I say there is an uproar, especially in the UK, about the casting of an American actress to portray one of their most beloved royals. The film is called Spencer, and it takes place in the early 90s when, during the Christmas holidays, Princess Diana, the mother of Prince Harry and Prince William made the decision to leave the royal family and her husband ending a marriage that she considered to be a farce, knowing that her husband was in love with another woman who is currently his spouse, Camilla. Deanna, we're reading that she's already in the lead as an Oscar favorite. Bill, based on the criticism that I am seeing, I don't know about it all of that. A lot of people are questioning her ability to even execute a British accent. So we shall see what her level of acting skills are. The director who handpicked her and cast her in the role feels that she can pull it off. We shall see. All right, let's turn to the loss of a pretty big name. Yes, the Kennedy family, the last living sibling of President John Kennedy, uh, has made her transition this week. She was also the former ambassador to Ireland, and it was the first time in American politics that, that her father was also an ambassador to England, and then she, of course, to Ireland, but she died at the age of 92. Deanna, I like that you use the word transition. I think that really paints the right picture, but let's transition to something that, well, maybe not as serious, sex scenes in a soap opera. This is a weird one. The Bold and the Beautiful, like many other television and film productions, Bill, shut down in mid-March because of the coronavirus pandemic. However, they have resumed production and are practicing safe distance, social distancing. How do you do that on a soap opera? And how about sex scenes, Bill? Get this. They are using spouses and significant others of the actors to do the sex scenes, and in some cases, a blow-up doll as well. So they're using uh, trick photography. There's gonna be a COVID, how about this? A COVID-19 coordinator on set, and all the actors and crew will be tested once a week. Thanks, Deanna. Really, nothing I can add to that.